Welcome to this Electric Radiators Direct video guide. Today we will be looking at how to use Smart Life Scenes. The Smart Life app is a third party smart home management app which is compatible with our Wi Fi enabled EcoStrad and Moda heaters. You can use this app to set up, control, and automate your heaters, but please keep in mind that the app is subject to changes. The Smart Life app allows you to set up specialised routines for your devices, called scenes. There are two types of scenes. Tap to run scenes, which are routines triggered by tapping a button on your home screen, and automations, which are automatically triggered, such as by a change in the weather or at a specific time of day. In today's video, we will be showing you how to set up two useful scenes that you might use in your everyday life. In this first scenario, we want our heating to heat to a high temperature for a short period of time before lowering the temperature again. To set up a boost button that will do this, first open the Smart Life app and go to the Scene tab. Once here, click the plus icon in the top right corner, or if this is your first scene, click Create Scene. Then you will be asked to choose the type of scene you want to create. For a boost, we're going to be using Tap to Run. This is the scene setup screen. Here you can see the trigger, which in this case is the Tap to Run button that will be created, and the action, which is currently empty. Click the plus icon or Add Task to add an action. Click Run the device, then choose the first device you want to boost from the list. If you see no devices in this list, it means you haven't added any scene compatible devices yet. You will now see a list of functions that the device can do. As we are setting up a boost, click set temperature and choose a high temperature. I'm setting mine to 30 degrees for a big boost of heat. Then press next and you will return to the scene setup screen. Repeat the process to add any other devices to this boost. Now, let's set up a timer for our boost. Press the plus icon and choose Delay the action from the list. This will delay any further actions you add to this scene. Pick how long you want the boost to run for, in my case, two hours, and then click Next to return to the scene setup screen. Finally, let's tell the heater to return to a lower temperature at the end of the boost. Press the plus icon again and choose Run the device from the list. Select the same heater as before, then click Set temperature and choose a lower temperature for the heater to return to, such as, in my example, 21 degrees. You could also choose a mode for the heater to switch to, if your heater allows it, but in this example we will just adjust the temperature. Click Next to confirm. If you have any other heaters in this boost, repeat the process of setting a lower temperature for each of them. You are nearly finished setting up your boost. All that is left to do is to customise the button used to start this scene. Click the three dots in the top right of the screen to open the More tab. Here, you can change the name of the scene, pick the colour and icon of the button, and toggle whether the button will appear on your home screen or just in the Scene tab. When happy, click OK and then Save. As you can see, the scene will appear in the Tap to Run section of the Scene tab. If you allowed the button to appear in your home screen as well, click on Home tab and you will find the new button. Simply tap the button whenever you are cold for an instant, perfectly automated boost of heat. For this second scenario, we want our heaters to turn on in the morning before we wake up to start heating the room. To set up this wake up routine, 
First, go to the Scene tab in the Smart Life app. Once here, click the plus in the top right corner. Or, if this is your first scene, click Create Scene. As before, you will be asked to choose the type of scene you want to create. This time, we want to click Schedule because we want our wake up routine to happen at the same time every day. Set the time for the routine to start. Then click repeat to choose the days of the week for this routine to repeat on. Our wake up routine is for work days, so we will select Monday to Friday. Click the back arrow, then press next to go to the scene setup screen. You will see that the trigger for this scene is the time you have just set. Click the plus icon or add task, then choose run the device. Select the device, then tell the radiator to turn on by tapping switch and choosing on. Select next to return to the scene setup screen. Now repeat the process to add any other heaters to this routine. When you are happy with your scene, click the three dots in the top right corner. Here, you can change the name of the scene. Tap OK, then save. The app will ask you whether you want to start using the automation straight away. If you do, tap yes. Now you will see your automation in the automation list of the scene tab. If you want to deactivate the routine, tap the green slider. You have now seen how to set up Smart Life Scenes and how to use them to improve your heating. There are almost endless configurations of scenes you can set up with Smart Life, allowing you to tailor your heating to match your lifestyle perfectly. For example, you could set up a maximum heating threshold that automatically turns down the set temperature if somebody sets it too high, an automation that turns off your heating if it is warm and sunny outside, or geolocation that automatically turns on your heating when you are within a certain radius of your house. Thank you for watching this video. For more information on using the Smart Life app, check out our videos on setting up the Smart Life app or using homes on Smart Life. If you have any more questions, give us a call. Our friendly advisors are always happy to help.